Welcome. Welcome to New Light Living Podcast. I'm Marika Sullivan, and I'm an intuitive spiritual life coach. Today, we're going to talk about how to love yourself and be confident no matter what. And at these times, it's really, really important to love yourself when you're trying to maybe even pivot into a new direction for yourself in your life. And it's so easy to lose that self-confidence and begin to doubt yourself. And most of all, feeling alone in that new journey of yours. So today I'd like to give you three powerful tips on how to bring back that trust in yourself, that love in yourself and to believe in yourself so that you can step into that new direction, that feeling powerful and loving yourself. The first tip is become clear on what it is that makes you not love yourself. Because this feeling of, nah, I don't really believe in myself or I don't love myself even, it can be a very general feeling at the very surface. And it feels like it's a little muddled, I don't really know. And that means that you haven't really identified exactly what it is that makes you feel that way. And often that could be a beautiful way to do together with a coach. Uh, and also, one th other thing is that don't exclude yourself from your situation, your life, and how you feel. Because often it's very common that we blame others for how we feel or how we, our situation in life and where we're at at the moment. But it's very important to include yourself don't exclude yourself from your life and your situation. Because when you become more clear about your situation and what it is that makes you feel unloved, you can then step into your power and decide what part of that are you engaging in and what part are you going to let go. So clarity is a very important first step in increasing your self-love. The second tip is see yourself as part of a whole. And I would argue that this video is not about you. It is about us. And when we have a feeling and a perspective of being part of a whole, we invite a bigger sensation that we're part of a universe that is supportive of us and that everyone else is also part of that energy. So, and, and that when we feel alone and unloved in life, it's often that we separate ourselves. I'm over here and everybody else is over there. But when you can invite a feeling of I'm part of a whole, we're all linked together and my life is also linked to everybody else's life, we can expand our view of our role in this world and why we're here. So I recommend to invite that feeling of I'm even if I feel alone or not loved at the moment, invite that in sensation of oneness and whole. The third tip is to tap into the unlimited resources of the universe and tap into all the support for that is already available for you there. And often I also recommend to start looking at signs and synchronicities in your life that is actually nudging you ahead. Because sometimes when we're losing our self-love or don't feel it as much, it is because we're, we're just not looking for those positive signs that the universe is giving us. So I invite you to take a look the next two days, whether you can see a repeating pattern, or maybe you see a bird twice, maybe a feather on the floor, maybe you see also numbers that are coming up in your day repeatedly. Those are signs and other synchronicities. So the more you can start listening and viewing and seeing those signs and synchronicities, the better, the more tapped into the universe you're going to become. Another really powerful way to tap into the, the power of the universe is to visualize. And visualizing 
where you want to be when you are at your best. And this is really important because sometimes we keep thinking and uh, spending energy on our situation we're in now, which if you clicked on this video, it might be that you're interested in increasing your, your support for yourself in some way. And we often spend time on the situation we're in. If you want to be in a different situation, let's say you want to increase your self-love, bring in that energy of how it feels and when you are at your best and see yourself today like that, because that is going to grow the, your energy of self-love, grow your energy of believe in yourself no matter what. Um, the question also becomes, how do you want to show up? How do you want to feel? And the, a way of doing that is to actually go back and to a time in your life where you felt really loved by yourself. And you take that little nugget of energy and situation and how can you bring that back today? Just by grabbing that energy from the past, bringing it into today, that's going to allow you to shift your perspective on yourself and the belief in yourself. And it's an energetic shift. So practice that when you feel you need a little extra boost of self-love. So I wanna summarize. Step one, be really clear on what is it that is making you not love yourself. And working with a coach can be really, really powerful here to help you navigate through that and may help you make that clear for yourself. The second tip is see yourself as part of a whole. And the third is to tap into the universe and the supportive signs and synchronicities and the energy of visualization to really boost your energy and support and loving yourself and believe yourself. You are going to feel confident no matter what. Thank you so much. See you soon.